Hello everyone. Welcome back to today's topic of the day. Today we'll be talking about the cold wave in North India, its factors, causes, impacts and precautions that can be taken. Now according to the India Meteorological Department IMD, many parts of North India will continue to face a cold wave in the coming days. Now let's understand what is a cold wave. A cold wave also known as cold spell, cold snap or arctic snap is a cooling of the air caused by a range of factors. The IMD however defines a cold wave in the plains of North India as a dip in minimum temperature to 4.5 degrees Celsius with overall temperature dropping to under 10 degrees Celsius for at least two consecutive days. Further, in the hills a cold wave is only declared when the temperature touches 0 degrees Celsius. Not talking about severe cold wave, now if the temperature in the plains falls further to 2 degrees Celsius or mean average of below 6.4 degrees Celsius, the IMD declares it a severe cold wave. According to the IMD, a severe cold wave is a air temperature that can become lethal to the human body when exposed. Now coming to what causes a cold wave, now there are a variety of factors that can lead to a cold wave. These are first pressure differences, a protracted area of a relatively high atmospheric pressure in the jet stream in northwest asia could result in a cold wave in india jet streams occur because the earth is heated unevenly and the pressure differences in different areas leads to wind blowing from one to the other second cloud cover lack of cloud cover can lead to a cold wave infrared radiation from the earth is trapped by clouds and with a decrease in the cloud cover more heat escapes from the earth's surface leading to a cooler surface and lower temperature Third, La Niña. A La Niña refers to a large-scale cooling of the ocean surface temperatures in the central and eastern equatorial Pacific Ocean. Warm water floats above cold water. La Niña is a weather disruption which leads to these warm waters being blown towards Indonesia. This in turn leads to cold water rising to the surface. This rise in surface cold water leads to a cooling effect. According to the IMD, La Niña is likely to continue from December to February 2020. 2023 and lastly non seasonal or non monsoon rainfall is another major cause of cold waves now let us discuss the impacts of a cold wave instances of flu running nose and nose bleeds would be even more likely because of prolonged exposure to cold human body's cold temperature hovers at around 36.8 degrees celsius to 37.5 degrees celsius if one loses too much heat from their core they run the risk of hypothermia and in worst case frostbite Now what is hypothermia when a body temperature drops your heart nervous system and other organs cannot work normally left untreated hypothermia can lead to complete failure of your heart and respiratory system and eventually to death moreover frostbite leads to skin turning blue or pale from a lack of blood circulation now let's understand the precautions that can be taken during a cold wave the imd has issued following set of precautions to follow in the coming days stay indoors and stay warm as far as possible possible if outdoors wear several layers of lightweight warm wool clothing to retain your core temperature and keep yourself warm avoid staying wet and if you do get wet change into dry clothes immediately other ways to keep your core temperature warm include eating adequate amounts of nutritious fat some vegetables fruits and other foods that are rich in energy the thermic effect of fat and other food will help you keep your core temperature up if you are using a heater indoors ensure you allow it adequate when ventilation to avoid inhaling any potentially deadly fumes now that was a little bit about cold waves let's take a practice question from the topic consider the statements with respect to cold waves statement 1 the imd defines a cold wave in plains of north india as a dip in minimum temperature to 4.5 degrees celsius with overall temperature dropping to under 10 degrees celsius for at least two consecutive days statement 2 If the temperature in the plains falls further to 2 degrees Celsius or a mean average of below 6.4 degrees Celsius, the IMD declares it as severe cold wave. Now, which of the statements given above are correct? You may take a moment and give your answer in the comment section below. Now the correct answer is C that is both the statement 1 and 2 are correct I hope you liked the video and found the information useful you may also check out our daily current affairs section on our website and for more such videos stay tuned to the next IS YouTube channel